Hello, and welcome to Starfield. Well, we've managed to track down Mia Cruz, as far as I recall. I think that's what she was called. Yeah, as far as I recall, we managed to get that far. So we've given Alex a slate. Now, apparently, it's a case of we need to go off to the meeting room to find out what to do next, because we're on this range of quest at the minute. I mean, there's still a main quest. I've kind of like veered off because I wanted to do this one, which is quite interesting. Because, I mean, at the moment, we're just like deputy Dan Dangerous. Hopefully, when we finish this, we'll become Ranger Dan Dangerous. Ooh, hello. Terminal use, mandatory. Okay, that was something I didn't really particularly need to know, but I mean, it was interesting. Well, yeah, never mind. I just, I just felt compelled to pick it up. Uh, oh, I like that. Recent messages. Fingers crossed, new syndicate. Another box. Shepard was looking for you. Well, that's from Diego. Oh, these are messages for Diego. Uh, okay. Again, I just feel compelled to, like, to read these things. <laughs> it's none of my business, but... Yeah. What about that one? So who's this? Is this is Alex's one. Who was that one too? That was... Hell, guy. Okay. Oh, okay, right. That's just a big much internal stuff. Oh, what was that? Let's talk paper tree. Right, anyway, I'm getting distracted. Come on. We need to go to... We need to go... Oh, we need to go to the meeting room. I'm proud to be helping right, the Star Rangers. Yep. So I. Come in, Deputy. Take a seat. Okay. This won't take long. Okay. That's good to know. What have you found out? While you've been in the field, we've had more reports about farmers being threatened and attacked. Oh. Unfortunately, some didn't survive. Oh. Oh, that this is really bad. Oh. This is really, it's really worse. bad. It's worse. It's tragic. How's your investigation proceeding? Um, well, yeah, I mean, once you get the encryption cracked, I think we should know, hopefully. Fingers crossed. I mean, everything's resting on Alex, just so you know. You know, no pressure. That's assuming he finds something useful. Otherwise, you'll be no better off than when you started. Yeah. Let's move on. I asked the other Rangers to share their opinions of you, and there are some things I want to go over. Oh, dear. We'll start with Ranger Callow in Hopetown. Ah. She was grateful for your timely arrival. And impressed you had the guts to take on those pirates. Okay. Nia says you were respectful with Ron Hope and didn't push too hard. That shows me you were listening when I said to go easy on him. Hmm. Yeah. Um. Yeah, th th there are reasons. Exactly. Dealing with the council can be tough, but it comes with a badge. No need to make it harder than it already is. I don't Let's like continue. Stuff, man. We've got a detailed report from Ranger Price about your recent visit to Neon. Okay. He said you took on a syndicate loan shark to help an informant. Mm hmm. Um, well, um, well, well, yeah. I mean. Yeah, I mean... And you were right to do so. Helping people is our most important duty, even when you're conducting an investigation. You got results, and that's what matters most. Price was impressed by that. Said you really took the initiative. Ranger McMillan praised what she called your uncommon bravery and dedication. Huh? She said you took on the Red Mile so you could get a meeting with Marco Graziani. That was just for fun. I mean, to be fair, it was, it was like, fun, but, um, yeah, 
things have to be done. Sounds like you're starting to understand what it means to be a Free Star Ranger. So what happened with Marco? I doubt he gave you that slate out of the kindness of his heart. Yeah, well, you know, I mean, um, kind to me. Oh, come on. I suppose underestimating you was his last mistake. Damn. I thought if anyone could see reason, it'd be Marco. What about Maya Cruz? Her loyalty to Hull and the 1st Cavalry was stronger than most. Well, you know, I mean... It... I guess I'd want the same thing if I were in her place. Excuse me, Marshal? Not now, Alex. We're in a meeting here. I know, but this is important. I've done it. I've cracked the encryption on the slates. Now, I don't know exactly where the first are headquartered, but there are references to a place called the Factory. The Factory? That was our nickname for the main facility where the mechs were manufactured. Under the terms of the peace treaty, they shut all the mech factories down right after the war. But they didn't destroy them. At least not all of them. Hmm, okay. Well... What do you know about this factory, then? Never saw it myself, but I know it's a large facility, mostly underground. Yeah? If the first are occupying it, they'll probably have set up defensive positions throughout the complex. Oh, fine. I'll go have a look. The facility was on Arcturus too. It could be a dead end, but if it's not, then you'd better be ready for a fight. Huh? If you have questions before you head out, ask the marshal. No, it, it, it's fine. Oops, I didn't mean to take that. I was trying to get, I was trying to get out my chair. <laughs> but I love that. I love that. Whatever You're it was, ready I picked. For a fight, deputy. Yeah, I think. Be careful, deputy. I'll, I'll try. Um... <laughs> Those first guys should have spent more time on their encryption. Well, yeah, I mean, probably did a better job of that, good old. Right, anyway. What I need to do, well... Better this than being some dust wrangler on Montara Luna. Well... Okay. I need to find out what... I mean, I'm Deputy Dan. I mean, what's my sidekick called? Because he's... If I'm Deputy Dan, what's he? He's just the adorned fan. I don't know what his name is yet. Yeah, I still don't know what his name is. Right, speaking of which, actually, what's he actually good at? Uh, I mean, he's good at weightlifting, so that would be useful. Okay. Yeah, I'm sure that's useful for something. Oh, yes, it's useful for carrying things around for me, isn't it? Say, there you go, it's always useful things. Right. We are here, wherever he happens to be. And I need to go. My brother in law just got back from two weeks in Paradiso. Really? The place looked amazing, but if I have to look at one more vacation Why? photo, I'm going to clean his clock. Okay. Scheduled to leave anyway. Gal Bank is once again it's in me. the crosshairs of gang violence on the streets of Aquila City. Oh, okay. After an interlude of stability, the Right. Um. I'm wondering, seeing as he's good at sneaking, I wonder if I can find him a decent rifle. If I can get him a decent rifle so he can sneak around and shoot things with his rifle, that might be useful. To be fair, he actually took on Mayor Cruz pretty easily. I mean, that, that looked like it was a breeze. And anyway, I need some, I need more bullets for my rifle. Speaking of which, there's not enough to do around here. There's not. Oh, that's, that's I think big. you'll find every gun gets a full Laredo guarantee. Good, good. Here's what I have in stock right now. Hopefully, it's useful. Right, what have you got? Head ring. Well, a suppressed regulator. That looks a bit weird. 
Maybe I can't categorize them. Hmm. An assassin. How, how, why would an assassin wander around with a shotgun? I mean, I know it's got a suppressor on it, but all the same, it's a shotgun. You've got to be up close and personal. Range, 15 meters, presumably. That's not too bad. It's 48 away, but... I can go to, say... That rifle, it's got a range of, like, 100 meters. Hmm. Oh! Little sticks. Please, let me know if I can be of service. Yes. Right away. Have you got the ammo that I need? No, you don't. Why should I expect you to? That'd be far too obvious. Right, come on. Tell you what. Um... Hmm. Let us go back to our outpost and I'll dump some things up first. That's where we need to go to ultimately, but I want to try and get more. At least more bullets for my rifle. So we are living... Oh, but, well, I say we, I mean, technically we're not. But <laughs> this is where we are at the moment. I should really scan the place, because, I mean, you can get some experience from scanning things. There's quite a few things to scan on there. Hey, how are you? Oh, fine, thanks, Ella. Right, tell you what. Tell you what. See if we can dump some stuff off. Right, it has no idea what to do with these dark degenerative tissues, which sounds fantastic. And, well, actually, I don't want uh, razor leaf resources. Let's put all of them in here. Comes repair suite. What am I doing with all oh, the comes repair suites? Oh yes, that's for the um Ooh, yeah, that's for the UC quest, isn't it? We still haven't got around to doing that one. So I got I got a bit distracted with the ranger quest there. I'm just saying. Right, let's see if we can go and leave some bits and pieces in here. Yeah. Open Open says me. Right, there's my little box over there. Right, we go to... I think it's an aid, so... No idea what I'm supposed to do with that, but it's, I'm sure it'd be useful to something or someone. Um, cola, pop, bourbon, butter. Oh, yes, butter. Ooh! Ooh. I've got, yes, I've got some cheese now, haven't I? Uh, heel paste. Ooh, I don't think so. Mobilizers, injectors, meal packs. Oh, an onion. Put the onion in there. Water, synthamate, or synthamate, or synthamate. Ooh, yogurt. There it. Where's the H? We're missing an H on the yogurt. How are you? Just seeing. Oh, fine, thanks, Lynn. Oh, fine, thanks. What thing is, I'm still alive. Right, Old Earth Cuisine. Cheese. Oh no, it's not picking it up from the book. Oh, buddy, dirty. Why? Why? Why can't you pick it up from the books? This makes no sense whatsoever. Right, if we use the cheese. There we go. We're going to end up with... What do we end up with? Project Old Earth Cuisine has been completed. Discover how to prepare a rhubarb and meatloaf at a cooking station. That is awesome. You've got to get your priorities. Right, so everything else is pretty much blocked. Uh, yeah, that sucks. So we need a level. So can I actually, what can I actually make then? I can make alien jerky. It restores four health. Alien liqueur. Gets you plus ten to capacity. Epic. 
carrying distilled water from. Oh, we can make a grilled cheese sandwich. A yellow giant splash restores five. Oh, Reuben, that would make ten health. Oh, wow, meatloaf. Oh, I think we're missing some. We're missing a trick here. We're missing some things. So nutrients and membrane. Let's try that one. I mean, plus 10 to carrying capacity comes in useful. Wow, we've got one experience point. Woohoo! Awesome. Get your priorities here. Right, if we go to... Status... 1,305 needed. Awesome. Right, well, while we're here, we're going to have a bit of a snooze. Right, and off we go. Right, I'll tell you what. Um, no, I don't want to go there. Let's back up. I need to find somebody selling bullets. Well, a Centauri. Ah, uh, Jemison. Jemison, Jemison. Where's Jemison? I need to go to Jemison. These are important places we need to go to. Launch. Try the commercial district. I mean, if they sell things, then maybe they'll sell bullets that I need. Or a sniper rifle. Checking your record. Industrialist. <laughs> Is that a fancy name for corporate asshole? No need to get personal. Hmm. I don't think this is the place we want to be. We need to go to Spaceport. I mean, I would have thought like the commercial place is where we want to go to buy things, but maybe not. Right, where is... there it is. That's where we want to be. Oh. Yeah, go into the uh, go to the well as, as go to the well as well. Right, come on, let's see if she can sell us some bullets. I am not a If it belongs on your ship, then I'm sure we have it for sale. Um. Hope okay. you're finding everything you need. I haven't looked yet, so I don't know. Oh, please take a look. I will. That was our plan. It's nines, nines. No, you don't have any nines. Why do you not have nines? Little sticks. Ooh. I'm getting distracted. That's not what I need. Thanks for coming in. These are not the bullets you're looking for. Dealing in art is uh, more exciting than one would think. Yeah, okay, what a floaty boat, mate. Right, we shall go down to the well. Well, well. But there's somebody down here that specializes in UC stuff. So maybe he'll have some. I'm telling you, Bianchi, something's wrong with the boots you sold me. I wear them to the metro. Suddenly, the shuttle runs late. I buy a cup of coffee, and the barista screws up my order. It's like I'm walking under ladders with a broken mirror in my pocket. Oh. And the only time it happens is when I'm wearing your boots. So, what do you want me to do about it? I want a damn refund. Fine, fine. I'll take the boots back. Just don't tell anyone you bought them from here. Jake's is a good place to meet contacts. It's got the right amount of boots and the right amount of schmooze. Okay. How do you have unlucky boots? This makes no I sense. I got contacts all over. Stock um, may not be so reliable, but I got ways of getting things. Yeah, well, never mind that. What about these unlucky boots? Ugh, right. The boots. I hate to admit it, but she has a point. What? She's the third customer to return the pair, all for the same reason. Right. The boots might really be cursed. 
Seriously? But... Uh, I mean, have you tried them? I thought about it once, but then I thought better of it. <laughs> Best not to tempt oh. fate. And besides, they're not of my size. Okay, anyway, um, so where did you get them? Like most of my supply from one of my UC contacts. But after the second customer returned the boots, I got curious and I did some digging. Okay. Turns out they were seized from a house of a ruling ship. Ooh. That alone is enough to convince me something's amiss. Definitely, definitely. I'm detecting a faint whiff of the supernatural. I don't doubt it. Either way, it's bad for business. Hey, you're a pilot, right? Mm -hmm. Maybe you can do me a favor. I have uh -huh. heard of a UC station at the far end of the galaxy called the Den. You go there and stash these boots in a crate, and I'll give you credits as a compensation. Um, oh, why not just uh, put them in the space? Believe it or not, I actually tried that. And do you know what happened? Some UC pilot picked up the cargo, and somehow <laughs> it found its way back to my store. No, I want mm. the boots gone. But I also want to know exactly where they are. Fine. Fine, I'll go and take them for you. Finally, someone to give these blasted boots the boot, if you pardon the expression. <laughs> Here, I'll have your credits for you when the job is done. How are you going to even know what I've done? Never mind, it's too, it's too complicated. Right, I need some bullets here. Oh, you're gonna have a seat. Uh, oh, okay. Why are you having a seat? Take the boots to the den. Find yeah, the crate, yeah. put them in, and they'll never find their way back here. Okay, yeah. Well, somehow I don't think so, but never mind. Absolutely. Right, what kind of ammo have you got? Please tell me you've got the ammo I need. No, even you don't have it. Oh, fiddlesticks. Assassin's Sapphire. Ooh. Grindle, Solace, Knife. But a drum beat. Solstice, some modified shot. That's a weird shoddy. Anyway. Ooh, range 50. Nope. Little sticks. You need something else? I'll be here. Yeah, yeah. Little sticks, they don't have any either. Um. Just one quiet day. Yeah, yeah, it is. It is. It's, yeah, it's, it's wishful thinking. I don't actually like the company. I just like the logo. It okay. really is a sharp logo. It's a, Who don't mind me. Designer? Just a weary oh, man resting his feet. Mm -hmm. Okay, so what exactly do you do? Oh, Henrik is an old friend of mine. I help out around here from time to time. But I don't just loiter around. I'm involved in my own business endeavor as well. Okay. Um, then can I do some business with you? Unfortunately, I'm quite old-fashioned. Oh. I only deal with associates that I know and trust. Yeah. But if you do a small favor for me, I might feel comfortable opening my business up to you. All you need to do is pick up a package from Red Mile and deliver it to me. You don't even need to interact with anyone. Sounds simple enough. Um. Never mind. Yeah, I'll just Fantastic. do it. I don't want to know. Don't tell. I eagerly await your return. If I end up in jail, that's going to be painful. Maybe a little, but that's not such a bad thing, is it? Better than all the noise and attention topside, if you ask me. Okay. Right. Stay out of trouble. Somehow picking that package up gives me the impression that's not gonna happen. No, I'm seriously not gonna ask what's in it. I'm not even gonna try and find out. Yeah, there are a lot, right? In yeah. space. Just do us all a favor and never turn into one of those spacers. Scum of the galaxy. Robbing, stealing, killing. Even the Crimson Fleet don't trust them. Hmm. Okay. Hey, oh, no I'll funny that stuff night. with that boost pack. Got enough flight traffic as it is. Ha ha. Ha ha ha. Latrina, if there's something you need, no matter what it is, 
Either I have it, or I can get it. Okay, well, I just need some bullets. You won't find a better selection or more reasonable prices anywhere. Well, it depends if you even got any. Oh, sh bullet cubes. Why is no The trade authority appreciates your visit. Why? I didn't do any trade. Oh, zippity doo da. Um, no, I didn't want that one. This is highly inconvenient. Um, well, where else can I get some? Oh, we've already been there, haven't we? Or have we? Is that where Neon is? Yeah, Neon. That's all good. We're going to go to Neon. Because why not? There's a possibility. Just, 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 well, it might be slim, but there's a possibility that you might have what we need. They say Neon's future is so bright, you have to wear shades. <laughs> it also makes it harder to see the crime. And accessories for all your hectic needs. Hey there, welcome to Newell's. Yeah, please tell me you've got some bullets. Sure, have a look. Um. Grrr. He does not any. Uh. Um. All right. Is all of Neon corrupt? Okay. I'd say the majority of the guards are rotten, and the few who aren't simply take a paycheck and look the other way. They have okay. Neon completely under their control. The Free Star Collective's own security doesn't even maintain a presence here. If it wasn't for the Free Star Rangers outpost, there wouldn't be a shred of justice in this entire city. Hmm, okay. I suspect we had a conversation and just never got around to finishing it off. So anyway, what's it with you and Rosa? I arrived in Neon almost, uh, what, 20 years ago? I had gotten a job at Xenofresh through a friend and started working on the loading docks. Ooh, smelly. After a few years, they moved me up to Kazimbas Processing, and that's where I met Rosa for the first time. She was my supervisor, but we hit it off right away. It wasn't long before we decided to quit Xenofresh, get married and start our own business. We've been in love ever since. Mm, sensible decision. Right, so what about this cigar then? Oh, okay, yeah. That'd be extremely helpful. <laughs> I honestly don't know what to say. Yeah, I'll try and sort things out if I can. Uh, no, don't worry. Fair enough. Just be careful when you're dealing with Sigurd. He can be surprisingly unreasonable when he's cornered. Eh? Watch your back out there. How? How am I supposed to do that? My eyes are facing forward. I mean, I suppose I can carry a mirror, but... I don't um... I think he's got any... bullets. If he's got any bullets. Better not be a waste of my time. Well, I don't know yet until I find out what you've got. <laughs> yes, let's. Uh -huh. Oh, footy duddy. There's got to be somewhere where I can get 9x9. Nine nine. All right, what's or up? 39 or something, whatever they're called. These sniper rifle guns. Well, it's not that one. Where is he? Where's Seagard's hat? Uh, oh, it's down there, isn't it? That's it. Completely obvious. No, you don't. You don't have the bullets. I need bullets. You don't have them. You don't sell them. Um. Well, hello, hello there. Let me know if you need anything. I will, but what about this, you know, this protection fee problem? Yes, I'm aware of James's objections. That's partly why I don't go to the meetings. Mm -hmm. But if I don't pay Dexler, I'll lose my business. And what good would joining the Alliance do then? So, really, I don't have a choice here. If they want to fight Neon Security, they can. But I need to protect my livelihood. Oh. Yeah, but if you all get together, you see, you know, you can tell them where to go. That's their theory, anyway. 
easy for him to say he doesn't have my debts. Hey. If I don't pay Dexler, I might lose my inventory. And if I lose my inventory, I'll lose my store. Oh, that's tricky. Um... Okay. All right. Let's see if we can... Give ourselves a bit of a kick here. Right, if we use... Let's see what we got. I've got a few things I can try, if I can find it. Ah, bourbon plus capacity. Chardonnay. Ooh, Chardonnay. Let's just swig an entire Chardonnay ball. And apparently that's going to make us better at communication. Right. If you don't see what you need, feel free to ask. Let's get back to where we were before. We can. But I still don't see why I should join the Merchants' Alliance when my business is at stake. Uh, so who exactly is Dexler? Dexler is head of Neon Security. Oh, but okay. he is less concerned with crime than he is siphoning money from honest businesses. Who? But it's not just him. All of Neon is corrupt. The only way to survive is to give in to their demands. Yeah, well, but yeah, let's get back to what Newell was saying. Easy for him to say he doesn't have my debts. If I don't pay Dexler, I might lose my inventory. And if I lose my inventory, I'll lose my store. Right, let's see if we can persuade you with the wise. And why is that? Um, we need go. Well, yeah, you've got to stop somewhere. Uh, start somewhere, surely. So you really believe the Merchants' Alliance can stand up to Daxler? Maybe I shouldn't be so quick to dismiss it. Okay, you've convinced me. I will stop paying Daxler his safety assurance fee. And tell the Newells I will come to the next meeting. Maybe I will even bring some beverages and snacks. You can't stand up to neon security on an empty stomach. I like your thinking. Security assurance fee, I like that. One. That's a nice way to dress it up. Extortion, blackmail, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> right. Ryujin uh, is hiring the best and brightest of today for our future. Nice enough. Tether and Astas has Ooh. run into some Ooh. trouble. It's too many people. Twice. You don't want to Neuro amps? <laughs> oh yeah. Boost packs. Boost packs. Got those too. Lately, I've been getting... It's too many conversations here. Right, well, solve the problem, mate. Fully stocked and ready to sell. There you go. He's not going to be paying any more payments now. Well, I'll be. And all you had to do was... Talk to him? Yeah. Yeah. Meanwhile, I was so damn stubborn, I made this whole thing harder than it had to be. Yeah? Given you almost went blind, working with half a kilo of fish cuts in your eye. Yeah, I'd agree. <laughs> and I'd still be wandering around that storage vat helpless, if not for you. Thanks for your help on this. The Merchants' Alliance is finally united. I don't know if we'll ever get a fair shake in the city, but it's a start. Merchants Alliance, assemble. Yeah, I don't, I don't think that has quite as the kick, does it? Um, right, I'm, I'm still not further forward. I don't have any bullets. And he's got bits and pieces, but nobody's got the bullets. How am I supposed to get these bullets? How many bullets have I got? Maybe I can really find them when I go out wandering. Well, I suppose I don't really want to sit around for 48 hours. Um, on the off chance they get a like restock. Was it nine by nine by 39? Right, let's have a look. I need to get rid of these unlucky boots, I think. 
So let's travel to the den. Okay. Let's head in, head in the direction of the wolf system. And get rid of these unlucky boots, because I don't want to be carrying them around. get there eventually. Ooh, we've discovered a location. Woohoo! We've got 66 experience points as well. How lucky can you get? That's a lot of solar panels I'm noticing down there. I think a lot of them down there, so that, that's a clever way to power their house, I suppose. But what happened to nuclear? Why did you not go that, in that direction? Almost there. Right, let's go get rid of these crazy. I mean, I suppose I could. Can I try the one? No, no, no. Don't even think about it. They're haunted. And we're docking. And complete. Easy peasy. Good to know. Right, so, uh, we need to go and put these in a. Actually, I had to thought. Um, I'm just trying to see if we can actually use these boots. They come under. I mean, where are they? Never mind. Never mind. Wherever they are, then, then we have to get rid of them because they're just, it's just a bad idea. How about Private my sector. foot up your ass? Now that's where the Boy, real money's that at. That a big enough scoop for you? Ow. I really don't think that's appropriate talk coming from a Vanguard pilot. That's exactly your problem. You don't think. If you weren't such a lousy reporter, you wouldn't be stuck all the way out here. Ooh. I mean, I guess maybe that's true, but uh, if so, you're just as stuck out here as I am. So what does that say? Oh, Ooh. wow. You really do want me to kick your ass, don't ya? <laughs> All right, that's enough. Bastion, go cool off. Get a drink. Whatever. Fine. Holden, I appreciate that you have a job to do. I really do. But you need to consider that you don't operate in a vacuum. If you're stationed here long term, that means you're around these people all day, every day. And they're not going to like it if you're making them look bad. Lieutenant Commander Marquez, I appreciate your concern, but I have an obligation to SSNN to report on what I see. That is true. I'm sure they do know that, Holden. I'm just saying, maybe use a little more discretion in your reporting. Maybe a lot. Don't worry. When the next big story breaks out here, I'll be sure to help you get the scoop, okay? I will think on that. Thank you. Well, that was one way to calm things down. Hey, anyway, trade authority. That's a little surprising, isn't it? Out here on the edge of UC space. But it's just so quiet. That's a good thing. We don't want a bunch of aliens suddenly turning up and well. Yeah, let's not even think about it. Um Welcome to the Trade Authority. I'm Marcel, and if there's anything, anything I can do for you, please do let me know. Ah, yes. Not Our stock wink, wink. may not be Cinema, as vast Cinema. as New Atlantis or Sidonia, but I will do my best to see that you leave here satisfied. Okay. And seeing as the Trade Authority is the only fully licensed operator for the den, I'm afraid your alternatives are, shall we say, slim. Hmm. It is a pleasure to make your acquaintance, and I hope this and all future interactions are profitable for both of us. Yep, no, no, wink, wink, say no more. Right, what have you got for sailing? I hope we have what you need. Yep, so do I, because I need bullets. I'm just saying. Seriously. What is it with these bullets? Little sticks. Ah, I need to find another, maybe another gun dealer. Maybe there's a gun dealer out there somewhere. Hey, newbie. It's a nice set of boots you got there. They for sale? I'll give you, say, 500 credits for them. They'd look better on me anyway. Oh, that is tempting. No, you, you don't want them. You, seriously, you just don't want them. I don't know. Looks like they're perfect. 
Sturdy, polished, and just my size. No. But fine. If you don't want to sell, it's your loss. Oh, I'm tempted. I really am tempted. But it's like, if these are like, you no, know, it's not. No, it's not even worth thinking. Right, that that removes the boots. So there's nobody here I can Everyone sell. Everyone spacers, scumbags and scavengers. They're like vultures, picking away at the leftovers of the colony war. You'll find them scouring through old labs and facilities, taking whatever's not nailed down. That is true. Yes. I, I can vouch for that. That is true. Right, anyway, what about that ship while well, we're at it? Okay, I don't remember going here. I thought we were going to the Red Mile. Okay, well, we'll go there. We need to do a beaver. Well, we're at it. Ow! It hurts! What do you, what do you mean it hurts? Ooh, our lasers are on Seriously? Stay still! How can I hit you if you don't stay still? Why have I got no guns? You have to fix things. Why? Why have we? Got, why have we got nothing? We're out of, we're out of things. Grand drive is entirely offline. I know everything's broken, but that's no excuse. Just shoot them with bullet uh, with missiles. We've got missiles. Shoot them. Shoot them. We've been through worse. Probably. Since when? I mean, how many of these ships do we have to take out of here? Both shields coming back online. Excellent. You keep working on them. It was very unpleasant. We must have burned through a lot of spare parts. Oh, jeez Louise. Ooh, that's handy. We just got some spare parts. Is there any more? Any more of these ships out here we can get some spare parts from? Because I could... Oh, is that all that's left? Oh, dear. Are we the only ones left? That's embarrassing. It looks like they're repairing things, that's all. Uh, that's part of the Crimson Fleet. Ooh. A Crimson Fleet White. Ooh, we're getting things repaired. I'm going to repair the rest of it then. So we're just waiting for the engines to get re repaired then. So I could do with a bigger ship. More well, people who could like focus on things. I'm just saying, you know. Anything else we can salvage? What's that? 
from the Crimson Fleet ship. I wouldn't care, all I did is come here to pick something up for someone. Almost, almost. Anything useful? Ooh, credits. Plus, I suppose. Ooh, another Crimson. Oh, it's a UC ship. Yeah, I think they must have taken all of them. I mean, they were 20 tickets, we're only. Yeah, I mean, our levels. What is that? We're only level 15. I suppose on the plus side. Yeah, I mean, we've got some extra ships. We need another 20, then we can start getting uh, Class C ships. Right, so let's go and see what we can grab out of this. Mm, possibly just grab it something like the other one. That's a pity, though. Come on. Good. Almost there. That looks like a ship floating over there. Almost. Almost there. Nearly. Almost. Oh, Dr. Friends. No, 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 no! That wasn't the plan. <laughs> Is that upside down? That looks like it's been kind of picked apart. Anyway, apparently that's where we need to go to. No, oh, I've already been here, so we need to go to the Red Mile. Ah. For some strange reason I thought the Red Mile was somewhere else. Right, so we've got to pick up a parcel. Who no doesn't love asked. wearing a spacesuit? Corpses? That's who? Okay. Right, never mind. We need to go and pick up pick up a parcel. Go Get to, out of my to face pick up parcel. before I put a bullet in your head. Ooh. Someone got out of the wrong side of the bed. Right, we don't know what that is, we don't care. I'm not going to ask. I'm not even going to look. It's somebody's parcel. It doesn't belong to us, therefore we don't need to know. Um, let's try and go there quicker. Right, so... Right, where do we need to go? Oh, I've got to go to that the lodge part. Right, fine, fine. We'll go there. Just saying. Hopefully we don't get scanned and get caught with contraband or something. Hello. What the heck? A bit odd. We've landed outside the city. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I picked the lodge. I mean, you know, just saying. Maybe I didn't. I don't know. Yeah, that's the lodge. That's where I thought we were going. Come on. Right, we'll head back to the spaceport area ish. But we've got to go to the well, actually. Ah, uh, there's mast over there. No, uh, this is not the area either. I'm confused. Because I want to go to the space... I mean, how do I get it to go to the spaceport? That's why I'm scratching my head with it. I want to go... I want to go to the spaceport, not... Not here. I didn't see an option to go there. So it must be a specific... Yeah, I don't remember it being a specific district that shows up, though. I mean, there's a landing area, there's that. Residential, yeah. 
Oh, unless it's there. Maybe I just go to that one then. I'm confused. It's confusing. Right, spaceport. That's where we need to go. So we've got two, two jobs to do here in the well. Nearly there. Almost there. Nearly there. But I'm still no further forward. I still don't have these blooming bullets. I mean, if I'm going to go up against the fist, at least, well, assuming they're there, I want to at least make sure I've got plenty of bullets. Speaking of which, actually, I'm going to do some more, some more of them, actually. Hang on a minute. Oh, it's a shotgun. Hmm. Right, okay, something short on short on some other bullets then. Uh that is that one, the maelstrom, so that needs six and a half mil. Boom are so I need six and a half mil bullets as well as the nine by thirty nines or nine by whatever they are. Coming through, excuse me. Go into the well. Well well. We're off to the well. Hang on it. I picked the well. So it'll be interesting to see how much money I get having dropped those boots off versus how much that person was willing to pay for them. I mean, I've got a horrible feeling they would have turned up back here if I'd, I'd given them to him. But... Personally, you ask me, the real New Atlantis is down here. All that stuff topside. It's kind of fake, you know? Yeah, anyway, I got, I got rid of your boots. Yes, boots, you did. Boots. You know how I know? The rain cloud over your head is all but gone. Oh, okay. Here, for your hard work. With a lady log back on my side, I expect the business to be less bust and more boom. Maybe. And let us never speak of those accursed boots ever again. Oh, wow. Wow. 3,300. Awesome. I got contacts all over. Stock may not be so reliable. Take your time. I got all day. Yeah. Um... I need bullets, six and a half, so 298, I'll have them. Uh, I don't think you'll ever sell them. Hey, take it easy. Yeah, I have a sneak suspicion, I mean, so far I only know about that one place in a key that sells it. Which is a bit funny. Anyway, didn't have any problems getting this package. No, 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 everything's fine, perfectly fine. Nothing to see here. Hey, anyway, here's your package. It's a quaint shop, isn't it? I like it here. Good for you. Here's your package. Ah, excellent. I see you've held up your end of the bargain. So, I'll do the same. Which is? Salinas Hardware is now open for business. I'll unlock the door for you. Okay. Feel free to come around and peruse my wares anytime. Good to know. Oh wow, we've got a level as well. Are you going to open the door? Seriously dude, are you going to open the door? Anyway. Right, anyway. Main point is, have we got enough points now for this stuff? Yes we can, so I can boost stuff in here, but I think I want to do weapons first. So, you can craft improved weapon mods at a weapon workbench and research additional weapons. So, put a point into that. To be able to do more, you need to craft five weapon mods. Um, I need to level up so I can then do the space suits. Okay, Don't cookie. mind me. Just a weary man resting his feet. Okay, that's good to know, but what about the... I help out Henry from shop. time to time. Not very often these days. But that's fine. Yeah, yeah, but what about your shop, though? Okay, then. Come on back. What do you sell? I mean, I'm, sh I'm assuming it's exotic things. Something to do with the fact that you've probably got Willow. My leg 
Legs only move so fast, friend. Fine. Right. What can I buy from you? Salina's hardware is now open for business. Okay, so what, what can I buy? All right. Take a look. Ooh, weapons and ammo. Right, please tell me you're selling the things I need. <gasps> and you've only got 88. Oh, fiddly dee. At least I can get some more of them, bro. What? Oh, hang on. Oh. Welcome to Salinas Hardware. Yeah, yeah. What about I'm weapons? sure I have something you like. We did a minute ago, but have you got anything else? Ooh. Corrosive damage. Ooh, now that looks interesting. Is that oh I might have, might have to do a bit of comparison. Hmm, not really into that sort of stuff, but I mean the range the range isn't all that good. Oh, oh, go out and get that for... Yeah, but I'll, I'll get that for our adoring fan. That's what I wanted. I just need to give him one of those 9x39s. And that one there, now that could be interesting. Hmm. Huh. So what we've got is things like that one. Now that one doesn't do much. Damage increases as the person's health decreases. Ooh, a furious shoddy. Each consecutive hit deals more damage. Oh, that could be useful, that one. But anyway, that... Oh, no, I don't want to sell that one. Ah, trouble is I don't have it equipped. Let's exit out. Nothing more. Well, I've got his attention then. So if I pick out... That one. I'm sure you will be pleased with my wares. Well, I hope so. Let's keep this just between us, all right? Yeah, yeah, you know, hope it's a Nudge, 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 wink, wink. Say no more. Right, that one there. We compare that. Ah, that's useful. So, it's got better range. It's got better accuracy. The key thing, ah, see, that one. I am quite tempted because it says it deals corrosive damage. It's interesting that though it says it, it damage increases as the health decreases. I mean it might be might be useful, but most of the time I use that to shoot like turrets and what have you. Anyway, never mind. I shall leave it. I shall leave it be. Where is my adoring fan? There you are. Look at you, free star ranger, deputized and ready to round up the bad guys. I know. Consider me your pack mule. What sound does a mule make? I'll practice it night and day. Um, I really don't want you to go on wandering around with a bit of a hee haw hee haw sort of stuff. It'd be a bit concerning. Right. You don't have any of them. So if we. If we give you. Where did I put that? There. If I give you that, and I give you, I'll, I'll, sp I can spare a bullet. Because I don't have many. No, you're not getting all of them. There you go. You can have a bullet. I'm sure that will serve you good well. Talk. It'll yeah. be hard to top it, but you always manage. Okay. What I need to do, now that we've got the skill then, 
I don't know if we'll be able to achieve much, but let's head, on, head, up, uh, head over to the base then. And head over here. We'll see if we can do a bit of this, that, and the other. Right, land down here. Look at that, we're damn dangerous and now level 16. So I just need another level and then we can start, we'll start add mods to the actual suits, I suppose. What a view! I could I know. stay here forever. That is, until you left. Then oh. this place is dead to me. Oh, sorry to hear that. Right, I've no idea still why trees go in there. That's a bit concerning. When you've got trees growing in your landing. Right, that's it's a bit unfortunate. Right, it's research time. Can you open my door? In. Coming through. Right, research. Can we do research now? So we should be able to do weapons research. Weaponry. Seven available. Right, so we can now do barrel mods, grip and stock mods, optical and laser mods, and muzzle mods. So these, these should be good. Right, have we got enough? Oh, yes we have. Oh. Got a bit of an oversupply there. Ooh, nickel. Right, so I, oh, I don't have any lubricant. Now oh, that's embarrassing. Right, grips and stock. Uh, tungsten. Ooh, got some overflow into polymer and adhesive. Right, have we got any more adhesive though? Yes. Awesome, so I've learned that. The grips. So we'll have to. Ugh, yeah, we're going to have to then. Um, get another skill point. Right, what about laser? Optical and laser mods. Zero wires. Three, I'm going to have to make some more. Saline's got some in stock. Ooh, bit of an overflow into uh, zero wire. Good, good, good. Oh, yes, bit of overflow. That's that done right. So we're getting that one then. What about muzzle mods then? Any titanium? Yes, we've got some in stock. Tungsten. Yes, we've got some stuff. Oh, and some overflow. That's completed. Awesome. Oh, that's a thought. Can we... Oh, it won't let me unselect them. Why? Why don't you let me unselect things? It's extremely inconsiderate and inconvenient. Right, so all of these, you need level 2 to be able to do them. Oh. Shrag pile. Right, so I need... That's weird that, it wouldn't let me deselect. See, it untrack the project. So it only applies to whatever's left. So I need some lubricant from somewhere. I wonder right where I can get some of that. Um, right, so I think we're gonna have to do a bit of flying around again. We go to... Well, let's go back to Alpha, Alpha Centauri and then we can go to Jemison. We might be able to get some there. Right, let's see. If we go to... Is it that one? Just New Atlantis. Go to that one. Maybe that'll get me where I want to be. Maybe. Possibly. Hopefully. Just thinking about it. There's only one thing this city is missing. Oh. And that's a statue of you greeting people as they enter the spaceport. That is a brilliant idea. If I knew who to suggest it to, I would suggest it to them. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Right, anyone would want. Well, yeah, well, yeah. As far as I'm aware, he's the only adoring fan I've got. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure you will. It's not as if I carry around any, you know, suspicious packages. Good, good. 
Right. Hoopy. So what did we need? We, we needed... Oh yes, we needed a lubricant. Is this the right place to be buying... Ooh, it's going to be a bit of an awkward conversation. Can if you don't see what you please? want, feel free to ask. I am going to ask, actually. Hope you're finding everything you need. I haven't looked yet, so I don't know. Oh, please, take a look. I am going to look. That's the whole point. Otherwise, I might have to go back to... Oh, I can always do with adhesive. You can never have too much adhesive. Uh, chlorous salines. It'd be nice if I knew how much I had to decide whether I actually needed any, but... Hopefully she won't be asking what we have in mind with that, but I mind. Sealant. We could do more sealant. Solvent. Titanium, yeah. Don't have a supply of tungsten, so I'll have some of that. That'll do. Hopefully. Thanks Maybe. for coming in. I've got a sneak suspicion I'm gonna be coming back. Right, so if we go and fly across the universe to wherever it is we need to be. Right, so we need to go back off of base. Because the plan is Um Try and improve our weapons now. Oh, fudge sickles. Um, Whenever I'm lost, I I'm think, only, I'm what would any you do from in my shoes? Out of what <laughs> not literally, though. When's the last I've time he delivered? Oh, well, that too many guy. conversations Trading happening. Trading random trinkets with you is a long-standing dream of mine. Okay, that's, that's interesting. Oh, I can reach the razor leaf from here. For some strange reason. Right, uh seeing as you wanted to be a pack mule, you can carry all these, mate. Games aside, where's the paperwork? Off we go! Did not get to another adventure! Oh no! It is an adventure you when you think about it that way. Everything's an adventure. Because I'm gonna clue what we're doing. Right, so let's go back to the outpost then. Jeez Louise, we are doing a lot of travelling here. Right, we need to go to there. Yeah. And we shall land on there. No doubt the trees will still be there, somehow. Somehow they miraculously grow after we've landed, I'm assuming. Because otherwise, surely the ship would have flattened them. It's probably wishful thinking. Still thinking about it. Right. Right, let's jump in here. Here's a thought, why do I need an airlock? Got a breathable atmosphere. Um, research. That's what we're doing. Uh, weaponry, barrel mods, lubricant. Oh, fudge sickles! I forgot. I've left them on him. Where's the crazy person? I mean, the adoring fan. There you are. I need your bits and pieces. You think I think. You zag, I zag. I am your sidekick, your shadow, your tail. Cadena? Yes. Take all my things. No strings attached. All? Oh, yeah. Um, I need all. I need all of these. There we go. Let's keep moving. Onwards and upwards. Um, yeah, it's a good plan. Although sometimes we do have to go down. It's just to, you know, find it out. Oh, that's full. Fudge sickles. Right, we go to resources, transfer everything across. Raise leaf resources, transfer everything across. Didn't mean to do that. Right. Since the game's been reset. Do a bit of this, and a bit of that, and a bit of this. There we go. Now build things using the from the overhead view. For some reason there's a it's a feature. It's a feature. That's that's all I can think of. It's a feature. Um, no, I didn't want that. 
Where are you going? Right, I want that I want that one on top. Why have we got no power? Hey, where's all the power gone? Apparently we've got total power of zero. How is that possible? How have we got no power? Oh well. We've got tons of power. We've got oodles of power. How can we not have power? Just sit. How am I supposed to put that up there? Like that. Right, so let me switch the view again. Oh. Now I've got to fiddle around with a mouse to get there. But I really didn't think of this properly. I didn't think it through. Right, hopefully that will help. A bit. Maybe. Looks like it's filling up. That looks weird. Right, never mind. If we go back to here, and I hope I can finish off my bit of research. That's better. Weaponry, barrel box two, lubricant. There we go. Right, so that all, that's all done now. Lovely job. Now, sixty-four million dollar question then is: Can I actually do anything now? So, we right, weapons, weapons workbench. What can I do? So, go back to my sniper. Uh, go back to my sniper rifle. Um, nothing for that one. Oh, we need mud too. Oh, we could do that if we had some zero wires. That would... Yeah, I'd really want the accuracy. Fire rate's kind of pointless for a sniper rifle. High powered increases the damage done. So we'd take that up... Jeez Louise, it would take the damage up to 38 from 33. Wowzers! Oh, 120. Mm, I mean, I'd rather do the damage. Right, so I need. I don't need anything. I've already got one. Oh, it's mod 3. Mod 2. Little sticks. I can't really do anything with that one. Right, well, what about the mutineer? Laser. That needs mod 3. Compensator. Intel. Are these two and threes again? Oh, we can do that one. So that one would do slightly better fire rate of 189. It's not an automatic one. Oh, it says it's fully automatic. So I could do that. I'm going to make some zero wire. Right, well, take a wonder back here and make some zero wire. Because why not? Hmm. Oh wow, 10 experience points. Woohoo! Just what the doctor ordered. Right, so go back to our mutineer again. Let's see what we can do with that. So, the internal. I mean, anything's better than nothing at this stage. Oh! Oh. I need internal mods 1, I haven't researched that. Metal sticks. What is it with this thing? It's like, is there anything I can do? I mean, I can put a laser sight in and increase its accuracy, I suppose. I'm sensing there's not a great deal I can do with these things. Stealth lasers. Level 2. <laughs> Level 2. Ignition beams. Level 3. It's a large battery. This gives you more capacity to save on the reload. Small battery stack. What does a technical battery do? Lighter. Uh, 
six and two threes. Standard cover. What about? Is it weird here? that I still get nervous around you? We're literally best friends after all. Okay. Right. Remove cover reduces the weird, but we'll get more damage out of this. So we'll do that one. Internals. Overclock gives three. Precision tuning increases accuracy and range. That's going from 50 to 57 and a half. So not bad. Slight improvement accuracy. So we'll do that. Why not? Receiver. Right, so that's that one done. So I'll, I'll give I think I'll give that to our adoring fan. Ooh. Oh, fiddly D. All the things I need are pretty much things I can't do. <laughs> Say, what the heck? Why? Why, game? Why go to that, all, that, all that trouble of research and stuff and I still can't do much of it? Uh, long barrel optic, a reflex sight. Compensator, technical grip, magazine, oh Scooby Doo, I've got all this bother of like improving things and I'm not really sensing any improvements, what's the point, don't really use that, right so that one so this is the one I'm using so a short barrel so a tech barrel Ooh, now, apparently we've got that mod, so that one will give you better accuracy and range. I quite like that option. 68, 24... Uh, so it increases accuracy, the recoil control, and re I think we'll go for that. Then, then it's already got a laser sight, can't get the recon sights yet. Ooh, what about the muzzle? I'll compensate this. The so muzzle break increases accuracy. Mm, compensator. Long range accuracy, hip fire accuracy. Which I usually do that. Although, do I? Hmm. Let's try it with a compensator. Optics. We've already got a reflex sight. Compensator. Grip. Right, so the standard grip. I can put a tactical grip in so we get. So it increases most of those things, right? We've got a tactical grip installed. Internals, high powered, nope, not doing anything there. Well, that's tempting. But look at, oh wow, burst fire. So, receipt says receipt, these are like receiver mods. Um, can I just have a bit of a, actually. Very well. This is gladly. I'll treat every one of your items like the sacred totems they are. That's good to know. I appreciate it. Right. Weapons. Tell you what, you can have that because I'm not using it. Uh, you can have that. Uh, you can have that. So it gets just gets rid of the weight that I'm carrying. So right, so in terms of weapons then, you're going to need a 7.5 bullet. So what have you got on you? Okay, so... No! Of course! I'm always happy to help. <laughs> it's all these buttons. Why, why have I got so many buttons? Right, uh, ammo. That's mine. So I need to give him a 7.5. Ooh. Don't have any as such. They're the white dots there for really for the ones that support radiation, I think. 
I don't give him one, though. Yeah. Right, what else has he got? Not that, him. So that means the caseless shells. Scroll, 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 scroll. Not all of them, just one of them. It's amazing. I don't know how he can do it, but he somehow he's he's capable of, you know, firing multiple shots with one piece of ammo. I've already done that once. The Equinox needs three killable layers of packs. So give him something from that. And no, you don't need all of them. Just needs one of them. It's a, it's a mirror. I, I just, I honestly, I don't know how he pulls it off. Right, there you go. It's strange how they're very quiet in a room like this. If you talk to them directly, that the, the volume goes back up. But while they're just standing around, it's very, very quiet for some strange reason. Anyway, what have I got on me? So 122, so I've got a resource, so I've got, well I may as well put these away. Yeah, I'm carrying plushies around. Right, anyway. Um, oh, I'll tell you what, let's do that. No, 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 that wasn't the plan. Oh, fudge sickles. Right, aid. We'll put that away. Um, put that away. For some reason, I'm a bit puzzled as to why the base, all the like facilities that you've got, can't take advantage of stuff in these cases for some strange reason. But anyway, um, stout, getty, synth meat, synth meat, synth meat, yogurt. Without an H, for some strange reason. What about... Miscellaneous sort of stuff. Uh, don't need them on me. Plushy. Oh, that's cool. I like that. Why am I carrying three helmets? These need to be sold. I'm carrying more things than I need. Anyway, um, oh, hold on. I'm in the mood for a mocha macchiato. How about you? See, that's very quiet. Gladly. <laughs> I'll do my best to preserve every item. That's just bizarre. It's just like, what? Right, he's got a spacesuit, he's got a pack, he's got a helmet, so there's no point giving him any of that. I've got your back. And your side, and your front. Okay. Right, I think we're okay. So I think um, uh, it's a long thought, but I think it might be worthwhile going out, going checking out this. Um, this is the base. I'm a bit miffed. I mean, I've hardly get anything done doing the game. Um, the weapons. I thought I would have gotten a lot more out of that. So maybe it's only like back of up a certain ones. Ooh, look at that! The trees have gone. What do you know? The trees have actually gone. Ah, useful. But this is what we need to be doing. So we're going to have to go to Arcturus 2. That's the plan. I'm going up against the first, which is an elite. Um, well, kind of like a retired elite, ar elite army unit. It's, uh, yeah. It's going to be interesting. To put it bluntly. We're all here because we're committed to the biggest question of all. What's out there?
You're part of Constellation now. Part of our family. We do not fully understand all that is at work here. No finer group in the stars to be unraveling this mystery. I'll follow you from here on out, Captain. Grab jump is ready. I love this part. These artifacts could be everything we've been looking for. Another great secret the universe is asking us to unravel. Human settlements throughout the galaxy could be at risk. We are not stopping. Whatever lies at the end of this road will change humanity forever. This is where we belong. <laughs> <laughs>